Okay, we're going to do our daily language for today, Thursday, November 12th. The first two, we need to correct the sentences. So, number one says, we ain't never hiked down the Grand Canyon. Capitalize the beginning of the sentence. Ain't. We ain't never. So, that's a double negative. We can't have two things that are saying not or never. We can't have that together. So, we can say... And ain't isn't a word, that's slang. We don't talk like that and we don't write like that. So we can say, we never hiked down the Grand Canyon. Or you could say, we have never, okay. We have never hiked down the Grand Canyon. And Grand Canyon is a, a Com, uh, proper noun, so we need to capitalize both of those, and then don't forget to add your period at the end. Um, sentence number two, Aunt Martha sent us a gift for Hanukkah. So Aunt and Martha are part of a name, and Aunt is also at the beginning of a sentence, so we need to capitalize both of those. Sent us a gift for Hanukkah. Well, Hanukkah is a holiday, so we need to capitalize that also. This is a statement, so we need to make sure we have our period at the end. Okay, number three says, the U in mule sounds like the vowel sounds in. So mule is a long vowel. So we're looking for the one that has a long vowel. Pull, that does not have a long vowel. It has a short vowel. Mule and tool. That does sound like the long U. Mule and tune. Mu and tu. So they both have the long vowel. Music. Mule. So that has a long vowel where it says its name. It says U in it. Okay. Pull, it has more of a uh, uh sound. So not a, not a U sound, but a uh sound. So the last three should be circled. Number four and five, you had to write whether it was a command, statement, question, or exclamation. So if we look at number four, it says, look out for that car. Look out for that car. So is it a command? Yes, it's telling you what to do. Most likely, if it's saying, look out for that car, you are going to end in an exclamation, but in this case, just because it has an exclamation doesn't make it an exclamation sentence. It's a command because it's telling you what to do. Number five says, half of one dollar is 50 cents. Okay, half of one dollar is 50 cents, and there's no punctuation, I guess, because they don't want you to just look at the punctuation and know what it is automatically, but this says half of one dollar is fifty cents. It's not asking a question. It's not anything exciting, so it can't be an exclamation. It's not telling us what to do, so it can't be a command. It's just stating something. Half of a dollar is fifty cents, so that would be a statement. Okay. Now that's your daily language for today. Don't forget to go back on these sentences and rewrite them out on the line using the correct corrections we have done. Okay?